Hey guys, today we're going to be taking a look at the Pine Ridge Chenon Blanc and Viognier uh, 2018 Vintage. Alright, so this wine is coming to us from Northern California, uh, more specifically the Clarksburg region, uh, which is situated uh, just to the east of the Sacramento River and is re commonly referred to as the Gem of the Delta. Now, this area is really well suited uh, to a lot of uh, white grape varietals, uh, including a lot of uh, Rhone-like grapes, uh, sort of like the Viognier, and uh, of course others like uh, the beautiful Chenon Blanc that is uh, used in this blend. This region also gets uh, a bit of a maritime influence from the cool winds coming in off of the Pacific, uh, which lend to uh, warm days and chilly nights and overall a fairly long growing season. But that's enough talking, let's get to tasting. So the very first thing we're going to do is uh, we're going to hold up our wine to a white background to kind of get a nice view of the color without anything influencing that for us. So we have a very pale sort of straw color to it. And then you want to give it a little bit of a swirl and kind of get it moving around and see if you shake up any visible sediments. This wine seems to be pre pretty clear. And uh, for our next step, we're going to bring it up to our nose. And you don't want to bring it too close because then the aromas could overpower and kind of give you a false sense of what you're smelling. Um, so just kind of a bit of a, a bit of a ways away, and uh, give it a little bit of a sniff. And um, for this one, it's a very lush, aromatic wine uh, with qualities of, uh, of honeysuckle, uh, orange blossoms, so a lot of these uh, floral notes, and then uh, you get a little bit of uh, green apple to it. So, on the front of the palate, this wine is uh, it's rather bright and, uh, and juicy and fruit forward and is categorized, uh, to me at least, by a sort of a ripe grapefruit, uh, maybe a sweet apple jelly, um, and then there are these aromatic qualities sort of creeping in there that are reminiscent of uh, like a fresh ginger. And now, these are met sort of halfway through by this refreshing acidity that kind of picks up and uh, helps carry the wine through to a lengthy, satisfying finish. When all is said and done, this is an excellent, well-balanced wine, and it's going to find itself uh, right at home alongside seafood or anything spicy, really. So Thai curry, uh, shrimp, or uh, even as the perfect pre-meal pour to kind of accompany your hors d'oeuvres. Um, so stop by Simply Divine, and uh, you can try a bottle for yourself, or we can help you find something from our vast selection of over 250 other wines. Thanks, guys.